Well, this is it, an occasion of true grandeur. The date has been ringed in red for months now, and the stage is set here on the Spanish capital for the UEFA Champions League final. My name is Derek Ray, my co-commentator to help describe all the action is, of course, Lee Dixon, and we're fast approaching kickoff time here at the magnificent Estadio Metropolitano. It is Tottenham Hotspur taking on Liverpool. Well, hundreds of millions of people will be tuning into this one. Probably the biggest club game in the world. Pointed end of the tournament. Who's going to come out on top? Well, Derek, we're just about to find out. Very, very excited. Well, something previous Liverpool generations grew up with. Now for the current generation, it is reality. Liverpool in the Champions League final. Lee Dixon. Well, how many times you walk down the famed halls at Anfield and look at all the pictures, and I'm sure the players of the present have done that. All the history that goes before winning tournaments, winning competitions like this. Now they can go and emulate them. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Hugo Lloris between the posts. Jan Vertonghen starts alongside Toby Oliveira held in central defence. Christian Eriksen starts alongside Deli Ali in central midfield. And in terms of the attack, Hyung Min Son plays together with Harry Kane. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. Harry Kane takes it on! And it's gone just narrowly widely. Well, not his laces, it's the inside of his foot, Derek. It's a decent effort. It's with Fabinho. Here's Keita. Here's Robertson. Son is in. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Roberto Firmino. Henderson. Here's Keita. Fabinho now. And Salah! And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Liverpool corner given. And they've gone for the short corner. Good tackle. Now Son. And here is Kane. Oh, he's setting the table for his team. Matip. Henderson. Alexander Arnold has it. Henderson has it. Alexander Arnold. It's a weighted pass. Salah. And Roberto Firmino's in there. He's unable to take the chance, and he'll be disappointed here. Well, nil nil. It should be one nil. It really should. Keita Henderson Deli Alley now well that would be straightforward for any keeper Henderson has it Liverpool obsessed with finding a forward gear now what can they do from this position and the exercise is to keep them out. Now Son. Given away by Tottenham. Alexander Arnold has it. And Mohamed Salah now. Preferring to go infield. 
Keeper trying to get right into his face. Harry Kane losing out in that little battle. Fabinho carrying a genuine threat here. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, goalkeepers will sometimes make it look more spectacular than it needs to be. Well, he made a massive meal up. And it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? That will certainly mean a booking here. And now he's on a tightrope. Trippier now. Now Sissoko. Trippier. Well, the more you watch Spurs on the Champions League stage, the more you think, Lee, they have a chance of lifting that cover to trophy. Yeah, there's a few more pieces of jigsaw to go in for me, but they are a team to be reckoned with. Every part of their team is emerging as a real talent, and put them all together, you've got a good team. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. And Scott for the cross. Now Sissoko. Deli Alli. And the counter-attack is on, options available. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And a chance for them to nudge in front. A Spurs goal. They have lift off on this colossal occasion. Well, at nil-nil, it was equally poised. Now look at it. Look at the change in the demeanour of the players. Well, just look at this cross, Derek. It's all about the ball in the box. It's a brilliant effort, and it's a great goal to boot. And the goal that was scored, well worth another look, Lee. Underway once more, Tottenham have the lead. Henderson has it. It's with Roberto Firmino. Now Sissoko. Navi Keita. Oh, an outrageous timing save by the Frenchman. Talk about agility, he's like a cat. And the corner for Liverpool. They've decided to go for the short option. And a good-looking ball. That is superb goalkeeping based on a genuine aerial threat. Well, sometimes I'm a bit harsh on goalkeepers, but that genuinely was a really good save. Will it be Harry Kane? And a goal it is for Tottenham Hotspur. Well on course for victory here. Well, let's take a look at this replay. The difference between a good player and some of the best players is they don't need to take a touch. Gets his shot away. First time. Nothing else matters but concentrating on that ball. So, 2-0 now. Henderson. Matip now. It's with Roberto Firmino. Now Harry Kane. Spurs passing it around nicely, but what can they do from here now? Well, he was being pursued furiously. The effort, though, nothing to write home about, really. No, I think you give the credit to the defender there. Just put him off balance. Here's Keita. Alexander-Arnold. Henderson has it. Now Mo Salah. Given away by Tottenham. Salah. Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Excellent ball towards the front post. And the defender finding a solution to the problem. Half time in the Champions League final. Well, we're not quite at the stage where we're tracking the record margin of victory in a major European final, but not far away, Lee. Well, we were expecting a lot more, weren't we? A lot more competitive football. We haven't had that. Very, very one-sided. Now the coach, go into that dressing room and earn your money. Get your team back into this. Change something. Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. This is Salah. Well clattered away. Now well, 
the attack promising as it was scuppered there can they cut up in the defence with the through ball Well, who really would choose to oppose Harry Kane when he's on form? Lee, his performance so far? Wow, he's simply the difference between these two sides. All the eyes will be on him for this second half. Can he get the hat-trick? Given away by Tottenham. Van Dijk with it. It's with Fabinho. Sadio Mane now. Is he going to punish them here? Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Now Harry Kane. Spurs have lost the ball. Fabinho now. Now Mo Salah. And Mohamed Salah now. Cleared away. Well, regaining possession for his side cleverly. Looking for Mane. Spurs trying to use space to good effect. And a strong tackle. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Lucas with it. Deli Alli. And a wild, wild attempt from long range. Not one for his highlight reel. Well, it's a poor choice. He's got other options on. Why is he shooting from that distance? <laughs> Milner. It's with Fabinho. Now, Son. So, a throw-in here. Here's Milner. Wijnaldum now. Milner. It's with Roberto Firmino. Wijnaldum. And it's Harry Kane. That's a routine take. Milner. Well, in the second half, trailing, albeit by a small margin. How should they be viewing this task, Lee? Liverpool will feel that because the game is so... Tremendous vision. He's really sliced them open. He has... Roberto Firmino! Corner awarded to Liverpool. He's driven in the corner. Salah! That is superb goalkeeping based on a genuine aerial threat. Well, sometimes I'm a bit harsh on goalkeepers, but that genuinely was a really good save. Only ten minutes remaining here. And he's beaten Dele Alley with the effort! Showing ambition to shoot from there. Goalkeeper has it. It's with Roberto Firmino. Sadio Mane now. It's a highly promising Liverpool attack. But will there be... Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Wijnaldum. A really sumptuous ball. 
So close to keeping himself onside, but offside is the verdict. Well, and that's his job, the linesman. Give those tight offside decisions and get them right. Kane. Llorente with it. Lucas. An authoritative challenge. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. And there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. And he's broken free. Can he beat the goalkeeper? Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Deli Alley. Here's Robertson. And going through Mane. Salah! Well, they inflict a lot of pressure on the opposition and that time the opposition couldn't cope with it. But well, we're going to see that again and let's see the cross again. It's absolutely brilliant. Good power on it. And then watch this headed goal. Let's have another view of that goal. Well, 2-1 it is here. I'll tell you what, it's official now. Tottenham Hotspur have been crowned Club Kings of Europe. Well, I never thought I'd say this, but well played Tottenham Hotspur. Absolutely brilliant performance, not only tonight, but also all over the season. To get to the final and win this trophy is a massive achievement. And well played, every single member of staff, every player, every coach, celebrate this moment. It truly is party time for Spurs.